Welcome to the Pilates Show, where we explore Pilates tips and techniques to help deepen the skill level of the movement educator while having fun. Hi, I'm Jen Gianni, and today we're talking about opening and releasing the upper rhomboid, so the rhomboid minor, in order for us to get more flexion extension and lateral movement in T1 and T2. And T1 and T2, for most people, get really stuck, and there's not a lot of movement in T1 and T2, and we see a lot of movement above it, maybe a lot of movement below it, but not in those upper T spines, and we need those. Those are really important, even for just optimal breathing, T1 and T2, it, it has to, to move. So the rhomboid minor, um, whoops, is right at the top of the, the medial scapula, and then it runs towards T1 and T2. So you're gonna place your little mini tennis ball at that area. You could also use a bigger tennis ball if you need it. All right. And you really wanna just make sure that you're right at that top medial side of your scapula. So you can really get the rhomboid minor, so you're gonna avoid going down for right now, because our objective is to really try to um, release as much as we can T1 and T2 and the first and second rib. So like we always do, you wanna make friends with the ball. <laughs> so you take a few deep inhales and exhales so you can really release yourself into the floor. And then keeping the heaviness on the ball, only if you're ready, you can start to add a little bit of movement, right? So for example, just the elbow moving up and moving down, but as you move the arm and as you use the breath, you wanna make sure that you're not taking weight off the ball as you do the sequence. And then you can add on by going into a little circle. You can also cross your arms and just do a little rock side to side on this ball. Again, 30 seconds, a minute before you go to the other side. You have your client notice the difference side to side. And for most people, it's, if they're really paying attention, it's gonna feel enormous. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below, on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.